it's Midnight Raven and today we have another unboxing. I have been shopping again at poundshop.com, um, all bought by myself, not sponsored. Uh, this is like my third or fourth video now and this will probably be the last one as I am filming this. It is literally two weeks until Christmas. But I have no tree up, nothing is wrapped, so kudos to me. So I have another big delivery. I've actually taken everything out of the box because it was so heavy. Um, but I have 17 items, so this might be a long video. Now, poundshop.com is similar to Poundland. It has £1, £2, £3, £4, £5 items, 75p, the odd 50 pence. And this time, I didn't just buy pound items. This has pound items, two pound items, and three pound items. So it's a little bit of a variant this time. I will tell you everything I got and all the price, prices. And um, you can possibly still get these right now. Um, I don't know that for certain. Um, obviously, you'd have to check stock. Uh, this took about five days to get here. So with two weeks till Christmas, you could probably still get an order if you were to quickly order while seeing this. So let's get into the items because I have so many to get through. So the first set of items I got were these. Now these are the Festive Friends set of four coasters. So all together, they did actually come out of the string in the box and I haven't managed to tie them back yet, but they were tied together. All together, as you can see, they are uh, ceramic. We have a unicorn. We have my personal favourite, which is the sloth in the stocking wearing some funky earphones there, or earmuffs. We have uh, Christmas T-Rex, because Christmas wouldn't be Christmas without a uh, T-Rex to hand. And then my other personal favourite, of course, is the festive alpaca slash llama, whichever one this is. So these are going to go on the Christmas table for Christmas Day and then obviously we will probably use these all year round or they will go in the loft for Christmas which is um, where um, everything goes. I haven't got a tree up yet. People do keep asking me, do you have a tree up yet? Have you got a tree video? And the answer is no, I don't have a tree up yet. We do have stuff to put a tree up. I have tinsel and that but uh, we haven't managed to get round to constructing the tea. The tea. The tree um, but we will do in due course. The next item I got was some more tissue paper. You saw this in another video. It's basically 10 sheets of tissue paper. You get the nice stag design and the silver. I'm actually using this to wrap the stocking presents up to save on wrapping paper so this was more cost effective because of the size of it instead of buying great big reels of wrapping paper. Um, it's 50 by 50 centimetres, so it is a fairly good size, and I've managed to wrap everything in the stocking so far in this kind of size paper. So that works well, plus I love the whole silver um, kind of snowy effect. So that was just a pound. The next item that was a pound was a personal favourite of Christmas is socks. So these were the Merry Sproutmas. These are men's socks. This pair is actually going to Marcus's dad. So these are sizes 6 to 11 and they just say Merry Sproutmas and they've got a doody little sprout on there. I mean how cool is that? And then the backs are just little plain snowflakes but I thought these were pretty cool and as it says they are the perfect stocking filler. These are going to his dad so um, he will absolutely love them. I, his dad actually loves sprouts so this will be Quite fitting for that. The next item that was a pound keeping in with the pounds at the minute was another pair of socks and this is the turkey dinner socks or the Christmas dinner socks. These are again are 6 to 11 and these are in men's and this is actually going to um, Marcus's um, son-in-law, son-in-law, brother-in-law, brother-in-law, his girlfriend's husband, however you want to call it, I can't honestly remember, brother-in-law, that's it, brother-in-law, um, so we've got some chickens, some sprouts, some carrots, I believe they're chickens, they could be turkeys, uh, but I think this is like a Christmas dinner, 
Again, six to 11, so nice, thick men's socks, what we like, nice socks. And then I think the next one is actually a pair of socks. Yes, we have another pair of socks, because I just couldn't buy socks off here. These are the emoji socks. Again, adult size six to 11, and this is going to Marcus's older brother. He has a Twitch um, channel, and he um, does like Twitch live streams and that. He's um, really good at it. I will put his link down below if you want to check out his gaming channel. He does charity streams each month as well for good causes. Um, and I got him these. He thinks he's kind of a, I don't want to say cool gamer, but I thought these emoji socks were kind of cool with the little dark glasses and that. And as they're only a pound, um, men love socks. And cosy Christmas socks are just the best, I think, in personal opinion. So we got them. Their socks are really affordable. And they have men's, women's, and children's, mind you. I haven't actually bought any children's socks. Um, I bought most of my children's socks from like Primark. Next we have is for the pets. So Marcus's mum has a little dog called Chalky, and he is getting this. So this is the Merry Christmas Drools, yes, Drools, Dog Biscuits. So these are tasty dog biscuits. I can't get into them because I, I think they might actually be done up. Yeah, they're actually done up. But what they are is they're just little dog shape, uh, little dog bones. Um, and they are basically just dog bones. Um, I thought he would enjoy this. Um, so a little dog can have four, a big dog can have eight, and a huge dog can have 12 pieces. Uh, Chalky's kind of a small dog. Um, it says that it comprises of cereal, oats, fats, vegetables. Um, so he'll love them. And they were just, um, one pound. So an entire dog tree for him will be awesome. I like to get the animals um, presents. I've even bought my fish presents. I didn't film it, but I actually bought my fish a new filter and three new plants for Christmas because their tank needed doing. Um, you will see that in an upcoming vlog I'm going to do just before Christmas, um, just to show you how the pets are doing. But yeah, the fish got Christmas presents too. Next we have is the little cat present. I've already bought Midi two other presents from the pound shop. Uh, now we have the little cat toy one. The last one I got was in like a bauble. This one is the little stocking. So we have three items in this stocking. We have this little furry kind of glitzy ball. Down the bottom we have a hard ball so he can actually like bat this one around. And then in the middle, which is unusual, we have like a little tug of war, which is usually resided for dogs. But the cat has a tendency to go for my shoelaces. So this is no different. If I just lay this on the floor and pull it along, he'll go for it, thinking it's my shoelace, guaranteed. I don't know what it is, but shoelaces seem to freak him out when I sit there and do my laces up. He's always a little fat in the little shoelace. Um, but that's kind of cute. So that's going in his stocking. He actually does have his own stocking as well. And that was just one pound. And then the other thing I got for my little kitty was I got him a new stocking. So now that he's a bigger cat, instead of having just a kitten stocking, I've decided that he needs to have like an adult cat stocking. And I got him this. Now how adorable is this? It says, Santa, I've been a good cat. Two little fishies there. On the top, you've got some holly here, which looks pretty cool. And then on the back, it's just green. And it's really, really nice. It's kind of like, it's like hessian feel to it. So it's proper, proper eco-friendly. It said, frosted paws pet stocking. And you could get a dog variant as well. So if you have a dog um, and you want to get a dog variant, they actually did dog ones as well. And this is gorgeous. So his little stocking will go in his little stocking. And I'm going to do it in tissue paper so he can actually rip them open um, and see if he can actually do it, which would be kind of cool. So this, again, just a pound. 
And then we've got a couple more items. The next item I got was also a pound. And this is um, for Marcus's um, younger brother. He's coming up to 12. Um, so this is the Victory Squadron for Men Eau de Toilette Spray. So he's in high school now. Um, so I thought it was a good time to start buying things like sprays and aftershaves and that. Um, my eldest, who is now 17, started using, um, like, I want to say, um, aftershave spray and that um, around about the age of 13. So this says it's the new improved Ed um, spray. So it's a nice size bottle as well. I can't quite, it's 75 mils. And it was just a pound, so he'll get that. And he's actually in the um, Army Cadets. So although this is like the Air Force, it, it's as close as I could get. So he'll have that. Again, just a pound. We are going to get into the more expensive items in a minute. Now we're going to get on to a two pound item. And this is the I Love Chocolate Fudge Cake. And this is the bath and shower cream and body puff. Now, this is actually for myself. This is 500 mils. Um, and I can actually show you what's inside this because it's for me. Um, inside, we have a little souffle or a pom-pom or a puff or whatever you'd like to call it. Nice pink one. So inside, you get the little pink souffle puff thing. And then in, on top of that, you get this chocolate fudge cake. Um, and this is the shower cream. And it is smells absolutely divine. Look at that. Huge bottle. It's a little bit sticky, so it might have leaked just slightly. But I can sort that out. It has been in the back of a van for like five days trying to get here. Um, it was redirected twice. Um, so that's that and that one actually cost me two pound which isn't bad the next item i got cost just a pound and this is the moose head face wash um it's called junk start hero now this is for my elder son who has a tendency to get acne and really dry skin because he does a lot of sports um, he's in a college all day, so his face just seems to dry out. This is the Spruce Your Look Natural Volcanic Scrubbing Particles. Um, so basically, it's just a face cream that he puts on, leaves it on for a while, and then washes off and towel dries. So I got him that. Uh, that, again, is just one full pound. Okay, so the next item I got was this. Now this is the Star Wars Stackable Meal Set. Now this is for my eldest. Um, he loves Star Wars and I thought this was kind of a quirky present. I like to get each of my boys a quirky present each year. Um, and you've seen my videos before, you'll have already seen Talon's one. Now this comes as a set. So his hat here becomes a bowl. His body is a cup. And the black bit under here is actually a plate. So the only thing you're then missing is cutlery. Now, if I could find Star Wars cutlery, they would probably be like kiddie size. The plates are technically kiddie size, but I thought this was a really cool jokey present. Because he's going to look at it and go, what the hell is that? Until he looks at the pictures and realises. Now, this was more expensive than just the pound. This was too, but like I said, Pound Shop has... All the same kind of stuff like Poundland, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 75p, and even 50p during Black Friday. So that was two quid. The next item I got was a Star Wars mystery egg. So this is going in my eldest stocking. There's just a Star Wars mini egg. Um, inside you get a pencil topper. Uh, you can get Darth Vader, C-3PO, uh, Stormtrooper, um, I think that one's called Bubba Fett. Bubba Fett? I think it's Bubba Fett. Um, but you get um, some chocolate in there and you get a pencil topper. Uh, that picture, I think it's Bubba Fett. 
He's a dude with a little jetpack. My son's just come home while filming. I think he's a little jetpack dude. Uh, while yeah, he's trying to, to look at that one. I don't know the exact one. And then, on top of that, uh, because my eldest was getting that one, um, I then got my youngest a little Avengers one. Now, I don't know what you get in this one. It just says... Fingerboards? It says you get a fingerboard in there. I'm guessing it's uh, Marvel themed in some way, but it does say fingerboards. And so many to collect. Again, it's just a little stocking present just to fill up the stocking as they're so old now You have no idea what to get them. They're not as easy as getting young people stuff anymore uh, It's harder um, and more awkward and then the next item I got Is this one actually cost three pounds, which is the most expensive thing I have bought so far on this site, although they do four and five pound items. This was a Fortnite item. Now, my son loves Fortnite. Everyone seems to love Fortnite. The only one that doesn't is apparently me and my partner. Um, so this is a stamper. Now, um, you can apparently get a variety of these. It is for eight plus. Um, because obviously containing small parts. I have no idea what series this is me, from That's from season three Okay, my no, son says three or four three or he, four. I had that skin But he's a stamper so I don't know what he stamps but on the back you could get all of these now on the site when I bought That's it funny. we were hoping to get this llama which was the picture we saw on the site, but if you read the fine print, it does say assorted figures. So when it showed this llama, which is what he wanted, he actually didn't get the llama, but there is an entire variety um, there. You can see they go that. In comments. They go you can green, see that. Blue, legendary and all that. Yeah, That's there, how they are in the game as well. There are a variety. So this is what we got. Mum, go tell something. Okay. Next, not next, next, we have another £2 item, and it's this. Now, this is the Glam Signature Aqua Purse. So, this is really nice. It comes like this, and then the purse itself looks like this. How cool is this? Oh, it's not the game very well. Alright, so you get this, on the back you've got like a back pocket, it's showing up blue on the telly, but it's actually a teal green, um, it's hard to show you what it really looks like, and then inside it's green, so although it's showing up blue, because that's my filter, if you look closely here, you will see that it's more um of a teal green color i can't really show you see it it's like teal green although it's coming up like neon blue um but inside you get all your pockets you get the middle zip um you've got all your card wallet stuff there so this was two pound there were tons of colors there was blue green there was gold you could get it in pink there was a red color um so i thought this was really nice um, and then you get a back pocket as well, and this is, uh, again, it's the same colour as the front. It's by this company. It's, it says on the thing, Lassage for family. Um, and like I said, it was £2, but it's so nice. And it doesn't have that weird smell or anything that you get um, sometimes when you buy, like, cheap purses. Um, so that was two quid. And then we have just one item left, and this one cost me £2 as well. And that came like this, and this is what weighed the parcel down. This is what weighed the most, and it looks like this. Ah, oh, it weighs an absolute metric ton. So this says... Santa, stop here. And this is a cute little alpaca or llama. 
Uh, it didn't alpaca. say alpaca or llama. It just said um, okay, doormat. And it looks like this. It is so heavy. And look how thick that is. Right. Proper thick. And as you can feel, it's proper. The problem we've got is my partner parks the car out the back. Now, it is muddy as hell right now. And my kitchen floor looks like a dot to dot. There are footprints all over so this is actually going by the back door to save my kitchen floor hashtag save my kitchen floor so this was just two pounds and it literally was the entire weight of the box had it have been for the fact that that weighed the box down there is virtually no weight in this box so all in all all together i paid 23 pounds there was um six pounds worth of handling fees that is the shipping and the postage i had a discount code um uh, because i've shopped so much recently i actually got five pounds off my shopping so the grand total i spent was 19 pounds and 97 pence that included delivery basically with the five pounds i got my delivery for free so I only actually paid for the items I got. So if you want to check out poundshop.com yourself, they're a really great website. Like I said, items can be as less as 50p or as high as £5. Delivery is three to five working days in the UK, depending on if you order during the week or at weekend. Everything is nicely packaged. I've had no breaks, no problems, no issues. DPD that deliver it. Um, kind of made a boo-boo at the weekend trying to deliver it and they should have left it. They apologised today or the man that delivered it today apologised for the weekend people who didn't leave it on the back door although it was stipulated on my thing to leave it on the back door. My partner was actually outside building a shed at the time so was actually here and had he have gone to the back door to drop it well, would have seen my partner well, it was a different driver compared to my normal weekday driver um but it did say on the thing to drop on the back doorstep so make sure if you do order from poundshop.com take the option of having it in your back garden leave it in your shed leave it in a bin leave it on your doorstep um, if not, they will just take it back, even though mine did have the option. So, all the items, like I said, mint condition, never had a problem with them. I can't wait to order more. This is the last one I'm doing before Christmas, I believe. I have done three, or this is possibly my fourth video now from them. Their items are just perfect. I've got no problems with the company. Their items, they all seem brilliant, as you can see. Even the really big items um, and the glasses I bought last time all came in one piece. Nothing's been broken. I'm really happy for a really off the beat company who I've literally just found like four weeks ago before starting to buy Christmas stuff. And I've had no issues. So if you'd like to see more from me and in the new year ordering more from this company, give me a big thumbs up. Comment down below your favourite item. Click the notification bell and I do load videos Monday, Wednesday and Friday with extra videos throughout the Christmas season. And I'll hopefully see you for another video very soon. Take care and thanks for watching. Bye.